Where does the term Grand Slam come from? The four majors in tennis are known as Grand Slams. Their grand part clearly defines the prestige, size of the event but where do we get the word, slam, from in this context? Basic research shows that it originated perhaps in bridge, whist type card games. Does it carry the same history as the Scandinavian slammer for their verb, to slam? I've always presumed this was borrowed from baseball, where a grand slam is a bases loaded home run, which scores four runs. There are four major championships, hence, a grand slam. If there were three or five major championships, I don't think the term would be used. As for why slam is used in the baseball term, I suppose it's because the batter has slammed the ball over the fence. The term grand slam originated in the card playing world, according to the online etymology dictionary in the 1620s. The term is now mostly confined to contract bridge. This appears to predate the meaning of a severe blow by about 50 years. The use in tennis and golf derives from this, a player who has won all the most important tournaments is said to have won a Grand Slam, and the tournaments that are counted for this naturally become the Grand Slam tournaments. For the usage of Slam in cards, OED says, of obscure origin. Does Grand Slam have some French origin, to distinguish from a Petit Slam? Now called a Small Slam, of course. Etym Online dates the single word, slam, to the 1600s, but not the term, Grand Slam, although they are likely connected. The entry for, Grand Slam. Grand Slam in Bridge first recorded 1892, earlier in related card games from 1814. Figurative sense of, complete success, is attested from 1920, in baseball sense from 1935. The OED has all the same years, apart from baseball in 1953, is Etym Online's a typo? I've antedated three of Etym Online's for senses. Related card games. I found an antedating for at least the related card games sense, OED, 1814, from the Sporting Magazine, for July 1800, the 1814 being a revision of this. This is under rules for the game of cards called Boston, which it says is a small pamphlet, price 6D, Gravesend, printed by a Pocock, and sold by Messrs. Robinsons, London, and the game of Boston according to the introduction to this little tract was first invented by the officers of the French army in America during the late war there, and has been since introduced into this country by the officers of the Russian ships of war. Complete success. Another antedating I found is in the context of baseball, but rather than a home run it refers to a complete success, OED, 1920. From a report in the newspaper The Garden Island, July 7, 1914. It was surely one, grand slam that the all-students baseball team put over on Kauai last Saturday, and most people have spent a lot of time since trying to figure out how it happened. Baseball. In baseball a grand slam is a home run. The OED has it from 1953 and Etam online since 1935, but is that a typo? Here's Babe Ruth writing in the Evening World, August 20th 1920, Wall ST, Final Edition, Extra. In less than two full seasons, 1919 and 1920, my Grand Slams mount up to 70. Do you know that the home run leaders of the American League ran up a total of only 72 in eight full seasons from 1908 to 1915, inclusive? Any more Brown Derbies around? Some others early users. From the UK Guardian and Times. Golf The Manchester Guardian, 1901 to 1959, September 17, 1901. ProQuest Historical Newspapers, The Guardian and The Observer, page 9. The Amateur, Ladies, Irish Open, and South of Ireland Championships is a fine-looking bad for one club, and it may perhaps only have been due to the unfortunate coincidence of the Lahinch and Abu Dhabi meetings that the Royal Liverpool did not win a Grand Slam. Sporting Intelligence, London Betting, Wednesday The Manchester Guardian, 1901-1959, April 3, 1902, ProQuest Historical Newspapers, The Guardian and The Observer, page 9. Last in a list of horses. The slough maiden plate of 103 solves, wait for age, penalty and allowance. One mile. Mr. L, McCreary's Grand Slam, three years, seven stone seven pounds, car. Seven stone eight pounds. Boxing. From a correspondent. The Times, London, England, Monday, June 16, 1919, page four. 
it should be added that Mr. Cochran has decided to present a belt to the winner tomorrow night, so that if Beckett wins there will be two heavyweight belt holders at the same time. There is not likely to be the finesse seen at the Olympia that we expect to see tonight, indeed there is seldom any finesse in a Grand Slam.